but every day you have the Pope landing close to you. There's loads of police all around there as well. So we're leaving Matera now. That was a really good day yesterday. We're going to go to the Amalfi Coast, but the weather there is shocking. So we're heading to the east coast of Italy You're in welcome. search of some better weather. Be desired, don't they? Oh, yes. Ten miles of this. Jeez. Well, we're in the rain. Rubbish. And the roads here are really awful. And it's so dirty. There's rubbish everywhere. It's like a dumping ground, isn't it? Yeah. There was nothing to say on the drive here at all. It's just awful. It's horrible, isn't it? Yeah. Not a nice place. I think better now we're here. Well, better now we're actually here in the National Park. Now we're park. here. Yes, it feels much nicer again. So, we're at our next pitch. Can you see the sea? And, do you see the dolphin? This is a super large site, but there's hardly anybody here. So you've got the restaurant there and a beach bar. Oh, windsurfing. Pizza time! Yay! Look at that! I got our pretty lights on. Oh, we lit up like a lovely little Christmas tree, babes. Hope people aren't dressed up to go to the restaurants here because we certainly haven't. Still got our hiking gear on. Homemade pasta. So <laughs> big expectations. For me, and I don't know what, what have you got. Clams. You don't know, do you? Clams. <laughs> you just spent Clams and mussels. Oh, is that what you've got? Yeah. With pasta. With pasta. Homemade pasta. It's going to be good. We'll be looking around. Everybody's food looks really nice, though. So. My hopes. We were full after the pasta, but the pizza looks so good. I thought we've got to go for it.
Now that's what I call a fishing rod. Well that was a super quick excursion, a trip round the Est. It's going to start raining soon so we're going to head back, get a coffee. Hopefully without getting too wet. I can see where we're heading though, it's looking rather... It's not looking great. No. So we're going to pack up and speed off back. Yeah. Full power on the bikes. Nice. Bit of a wet rubbish day so we thought, I know, get it in the washing machine. They have one dryer. Doesn't work. Broken. Try and have wash and dry your bedding yes bedding outside in the rain under the awning it's not fun it's not big it's not clever i think we're gonna have dump bed sheets tonight so classy it's like panto isn't it <laughs> wishy-washy in the washing taking a kayak kayak to the water. Through the washing. <laughs> I've got to say, it's a lot lighter without all the gin you packed last time. Yeah. Slow down a bit, I can't see where I'm walking. <laughs> Really quickly. <laughs> Go. So that's the one we're going to, just there. No, you hold it, let's get a little bit closer. No! No closer. Doing well, babe. I'm doing all the work here, aren't I? Just leave me. <laughs> We're just looking at Katie over there. Where she wash we can make her out because of all the washing hanging out. <laughs> it's only about 45 minutes ago while we sat there having coffee that, that I said to Michelle, it'd be great to go for a Kayak. Now we just need the dolphins to come and see us. We've had the Pope come and see us yesterday. Now it's time for the dolphins. They need to make an appearance. Come and get a bit of extreme. I'm sure, I'm sure they're there, don't I? Come over. Say hello, babe. I'll do my sewing. Please don't. <laughs> Please don't. <laughs> Scoot around this little island. Hopefully. definitely getting a bit choppier as we've left the protection of the bay. Well, this is the view from my angle at dinner. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can see your pants from my view. <laughs> oh. What can you see? Oh, shorts. Oh yeah, they're hidden actually. No, I can see hmm. a pair of socks. Well, the kayak is looking mighty fine there. Yeah. We've <laughs> literally taken over. That whole area. We've got the oars over there. Brilliant. Paddles. Who cares? We have wine, baby. Bit Cheers. of 19 crimes, the uprising tonight. Cheers. Cheers. What a fantastic day. Even though it was raining, we definitely made the most of it, didn't we? We did. That's what it's all about. Not caring and just enjoying it. Cheers all. Well, as 
because we missed the sunshine yesterday we thought we're only going to come to the beach over for half an hour the sun is so lovely and it's so nice here in the, uh, the sea yeah the choice was uh, drive over to Sorrento yeah. in the rain or stay here in the sun miss staying here in the sun yeah I might just go and see how water is actually I'm not going for a dip because I only washed my hair this morning Big waves come in. Go on, get her. Get her. <laughs> the takeaway didn't really do much because it's the end of season, so we had to rustle up something ourselves. So it's bruschetta. I had nothing to do with this. You've done an amazing job, Barney. You haven't tasted it yet. Lovely, really fresh. Lots of onion. <laughs> you didn't think we were going to sit on the beach all day, did you? Nah. So we've had some lunch and now we're going to do a bike ride. 25 miles, quite steep. We're going to ride along the coastline and up high into the mountains. Ooh, looking forward to it, Barney. We are just over there. Far into the ride yet, we can see the island that we kayaked around yesterday, just there. So the campsite is just around the corner. Fabulous views from here. This is what we've ridden up. It's like we've hit an oasis. I'm just saying, after the bruschetta we had with the onions, my mouth is just one big onion at the minute. And I'm just desperate for something fruity. The oasis is a cafe. I'm having a pile at Warren Junior. Got to peel off the, uh, what's the route we were going on, didn't we, to, just slightly? I don't care. I'd have peeled off, no worries. I'd have peeled off 10 miles. Oh, I'm so thirsty. It's a joke, onion. Oh, <laughs> didn't even get that. That's how like my mind's in a different place right now. Just get me a drink. Massive, massive drink. Back to beyond, this is. Yeah. Yeah. The dog comes, don't hesitate and stop, just keep going. Looks like we get to do a bit of off-road now.
Yeah, but don't hesitate if the uh mountain bike for this ride not the place I'd expect to see uh, an assault course stroke gym This is not good. No. We've got a long way around to go and it's padlocked. Bike's over but that is high for our bikes. Locked. Locked? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <Shit>. Yeah. <laughs> and these are heavy to lift. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Where are you from? Germany. 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 Yeah. <laughs> Germany. Very German. good. German accent. <laughs> <laughs> you recognize that place there? It's where the, uh, the monolith is there. You can see it, look. Stop! Stop! My god, your wheels nearly falling off. I'm not joking. <gasps> I might have been when, when it fell over. Oh my god. Yeah, because there's a big scratch on it, so you probably knocked your thing oh over. Oh my god, I've been at that ages then. You, literally, your back wheel could have fallen off. Oh my god. Jeez, good thing you're behind me then. I've been going really fast as well. That was a lucky escape. And we're back. Yeah. That was a good ride. It was quite tough in, at times, wasn't it? Rough under tyre. Under tyre? <laughs> under tyre, underfoot, for half of it, big boulders. But it was overall really good, apart from one bit where there's this massive six foot fence that somebody padlocked with the bikes over. Exactly, there was that man as well, there, wasn't there? 
Yeah, German. We helped him and he helped us. German guy was there. Yeah. Helping each other. Yeah. And also the dogs as well, but you just got to ignore the dogs and just keep going. Don't like the dogs. Ah. All good though. Time for food. Well, I've just navigated through the trees to get to the grey water drop off. It's not easy, really. And look at this one up here. Michelle's saying, lift me back up. You've got a bit of a lump on your right hand side as you drive up, it goes up a bit like that. Just okay. so you know. You can't really go too much over to this side because you'll fall off the edge. Gosh, <laughs> that's not the easiest. So update on the water cap, which wouldn't come off when we were in Dubrovnik. Now it comes off no problem. I think the heat on the side of the van expanded something, the plastic or the, the metal, stopping it working. So all is fine now, fabulous. This is definitely an interesting grey water drop off place. Literally <laughs> in the woman's toilet block. So we had to kind of pull up this ramp here, avoiding all the trees, but all is good. Exactly what this place is. 